I picked up this birdhouse for $7.99 and this large candlestick for $5.99, both at Hobby Lobby, and they had their 40% off. I painted them in gray linen by Wise Owl and I'm now giving them a really good sanding. I found this little butterfly sign at Dollar General and this little gate also at Dollar General in their little fairy section. And now I'm doing kind of like a dry brush wash all over my candlestick. And now the same on the birdhouse. Once that was done, I did the whitewash on the little gate and also the uh, butterfly crossing sign that I grabbed at Dollar General, just to kind of make everything uh, flow. And then I did just a, a coat of um, antique villa on the bottom of my birdhouse. So now I'm taking E6000 and just a little bit of hot glue just to hold my birdhouse in place. And gluing the birdhouse to the top of the stick, the candle stick. It's a very large candlestick, by the way. And there's my crazy room. I'm taking some more E6000 and a little bit of hot glue and gluing the little gate at the lower part of my birdhouse and the butterfly crossing, I did the same. I found that vine at Hobby Lobby as well they're really pretty. Some of them had lemons. Some of them had little colorful beads. Um, the vine itself was about $12 and I got it on sale. So you may be able to find something a little less expensive than that. Here that is. And I used a portion of it um, for the entryway of the birdhouse. And now I'm taking the remainder of it and wrapping it around the candlestick up to the base of the birdhouse. And there you go. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you'd like to see other tutorials, go check us out on YouTube. For paint brushes, paint, or transfers, chalkitupfancy.com. Thank you so much for watching.